Hello everyone, this is Archer Franks and welcome to another video of Terraria. So in the last video we actually went through a solar eclipse and a pirate evasion strike. You know, we were attacked by pirates and I'm getting a lot of golden furniture. And where is it at? Right here. Then I got a lot though. There's still some few pieces remaining from the furniture set. Also after those two events were over. We end up combining a lot of uh, accessories. We end up getting three Avenger emblems. And we also crafted our ice wings. And from one of the Avenger emblems that was missing out of the three, we made it into the fire gauntlet. Which gives us increased not melee knockback, inflicts fire damage and contact, and 9% increased melee damage and speed. With the modifier lucky, which gives us a 4% critical strike chance. Yeah, that's what we did. And to this video, we're going to finish off what I did not in that video. So. Here's the thing. I removed the tire's claws because I'm not going to carry it with me. I don't need it. I already have the ice wing. Also, I wanted to reforge some of my accessories like the frozen wings. The obsidian shield, the fire gun, I wanted to change it to more like a menacing possible. And that was it. Also, my frost spark boots will be nice to like get like a modifier. Warding is like the best modifier I'm going for. Um, I want so yeah. So, the other thing is, I got, I got frost cores. And I got it from a frost giant. I actually show you a picture of it from a screenshot that I took. Also, I fished for some crates. It wasn't a lot though. I think I need iron this time. That was it. And I got this ice bow. So remember where I got it from? I think it's from an ice elemental. And I got this meat grinder and a crimson key mode, which I need a jungle key, basically. But in this video, we're going to go mine chlorophyte. But before we head into that, we're going to need to um, make ourselves a drill. So I want to craft the frost core armor. To mine the chlorophyte, you need a 200% pickaxe power. You need 18. But I'm thinking of making the pick the pickaxe axe. Where is that thing? Because it has a 200% pickaxe power as well. So I need one side, one fright, and one might, and 18 hollow bars. So I need 18. Eighteen and I need one. There's my tinker. Here he is. I've been looking for him. One fright, one sight, and one might. Let's go craft that. Also, I'm going to get my bars. I think you need like about 54. Alright, so where can I dump some of this stuff? There's some stuff I want to dump, but there's no more room. I'll have to make more chests later on. I also want a slime statue, which I can use it to farm gel. Which I already have a ton of it. Just leave it there. So let's go right here. There we go. We got that. Pointy. An Amante pickaxe. Pickaxe, axe, basically is a boat axe and pickaxe. But I'm going to take my Molten dog because I can use it to destroy walls. Actually, you don't even need it. Don't not gonna destroy any walls in this video. Okay, so 
what are we doing? Let's move this over here. There you go. Alright, so let's craft the frost armor. We need 10 bars. Thirty. I got twenty-four left. And sixteen. That man has a forty-five defense. So now what it does, it gives me an eight percent movement speed and attack speed. Well it's seven percent actually. And then eleven percent increased melee and range critical strike chance, which is alright. And we also have a 16% increase melee and range damage. Set bonus, melee and range attacks cause frost burn. So I'm doing all right damage. But we're gonna equip our hollow because it has more defense. I'll probably use that later on. Once I get like a better modifiers for my accessories. I'll probably use the next video though. Alright, so we already crafted that. Open our crates first actually. And let's dump my money. Actually, why are you selling before I dump it? You're not saying anything useful. So let's go down here. I also managed to get three planum coins. Which is a really nice thing. I end up getting a lot of coins by killing the acre stickers. Basically farm the souls of night. I also farm uh kill the destroy a couple of times. So yeah. Before I head into the jungle, I wanna first test out this pickaxe axe. I don't wanna red beater the pirate has arrived. I wanna make sure this does mine chlorophy. As you see, it is mining. Actually, it is producing. Ooh, Plantera bolts. Let's check this out. Oh, it does. Cool. We are getting chlorophyte. So, mining chlorophyte is like another type of ore, another type of material, another bar. It's stronger than hollow. And. This one actually requires a lot of ores to make into a bar. It requires six ores to make a bar. So if I need to make the complete set, I'm gonna need 324 ores. So let's head over to the jungle. Cause that didn't give us a lot, that only gave us 26. I need 300 more. Let's open this, if we're going to do this. Hardy Saddle, Titanium Bar, Anchor. Just open all of them while we're here. So we're gonna leave our Frost Bow here. So what do we got? We got Titanium Bar. Uh, we got Prentice Bay, Healing Potion, Anchor. No thank you. So. Let's dump this in here. Also found a life force potion on the underworld. Oh, I'm not sure if I got that on camera. I can't really remember. But yeah. Speaking of the underworld, I actually explored the whole thing. Uh, what else? I explored the whole underworld. I did found two shadow chests. I don't know if there's more like hiding in the lava. I actually found the Sun Fury, which is like a chain ball and chain weapon, flail, what do you call those? And I also found a demon spear, which they both had like weak damage. So yeah, we're gonna dump this in here. Actually, that does melee damage. It goes into our melee chest. 
So the De Dark Lands and the uh, Sun Fury. So you know. I also got a KO Cannon from it. From hurting people. I think. Then we got the Titanium Bars. Alright, let's do the jungle before we get like another event or something. Actually, oh, also, forgot to mention, I built this off camera too. It was, a, it was a farm, so I can farm the components for the egg charm. And while doing so, I ended up getting majority of them. The most of them that I needed, I already got them. Except I still need to get the Bizarre, which can be attained by the Moss Hornets, and the Hornets, and the Toxic Sludges, which can be found in the jungle. And I still need to get the blindfold, which can be attained by the regular mummies. Any type of mummy tend to drop them. And I also need to get the armor polish, which are dropped by the armor bones and armor skeletons. I actually killed like over 30 of those and not single one of them ever dropped one. So yeah. The good thing about the wings is that when you fly up into the sky, you can fly all the way up. And then you could fall slowly down. Look. You let it go. Now fall fast. I also need to, to actually go through the other crimson hole biome that I haven't gone through. We can actually, we can actually fight the brand of Cthulhu a couple of times. So yeah. So your main purpose is when you're in the jungle, you want to look for a, a lot of green stuff, like very light green. So there's a tons of water in that spot right there. Then type over to the right. Yeah, let's actually head this way, cause we can make this direction go in this direction. So I saw some chlorophyte over here. If I don't get enough during um, this video, I'll probably mine some off camera. You, you can also make a farm out of this. You know, what you do is save one piece of chlorophyte and get yourself a bunch of mud blocks and go somewhere near the underworld and make yourself like a huge square like a you could go up by 10 by uh, 10 by 10 square it could be a 5 by 5 any type of size that you want and then just put the chlorophyte in the middle and let it spread over time it will start spraying over time so we need 324 to at least make the armor and then we need more if we want to make the the freaking weapons. I'm actually thinking I'm going uh, cr creating the chlorophyte cross re uh, repeater, the bow repeater. Damn, these mobs are tough. I'm about to die. I don't want to die. Uh, hell no. Those tortoises give you a lot of damage. And I do have my banner generation equip. Let's get this. You have 82. We're not even close.
shit. Alright, so I'm gonna head up here. So I already got most of the mobs down here. Over here, there's a Pantera ball. You don't want to destroy it with your pickaxe because it will automatically spawn the Pantera. You don't want that. Let's go this way. Get that. So we saw some more stuff over here. This is how the light food looks like. If you've been wondering, chop it. You got that. Just take it. So we need to see more. We need to find out where is more clarified. There's some up here. Also want to get the turtle shell from those giant tortoise. Tatter big wing. Oh, what the heck. I could make that into another set of wings if you want to. And, but you still need to get 20 souls of flight. So, yeah. We got that. Some right here. Another heart piece. Life through actually. Let's take it. So we're like seven away from gaining our max health. There's nothing over here. By the looks of it. Go this way. It's in Cobalt Breastplate. What? So where are the color fights at? I'm not seeing any. Oh, I skipped a huge chunk up here. Let's go back up here. There you go. Alright, so back we here. Got this. Mind this clarify. Damn, there's so many mobs over there. Chest is in here. Wow. Another chest was in here. Another far claw. I could make myself a second. Fire gun net. But this is what we're looking for, the clarify. There's some more up here. So we're almost to 300 and we're like 
or we like two thirds to getting the full armor set. Like one hundred away. So yeah. Found another B one, B thingy. Let's first craft some more arrows or more torches. Okay, I'm still waiting for this to drain. Let's see. Where can we find some more chlorophyte? It's a huge water spot over here. Oh, what? How the heck did I die? Didn't I have full health? Or was I burning or something? Oh, well. Okay, so. Anyways guys, it will be it for this video. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. Since we went and mined for some Clarify. I'm gonna go off camera and get some more. Uh, Arcane Nature's Gift. Yeah, so I'm gonna go mine for some more off camera. And then I'll get to you back after. With another video. And... If you're new to channel, subscribe, especially if you enjoy my content and you want to see more Terraria videos and other future gameplays, subscribe if you're new. And if you got anything to say about my channel, or questions about my channel, or about the game, leave it down in the comments below. And as always, this is Archer Franks. I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye.